Hey y'all, it's Ashley. Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we're going to be doing some red wine eye makeup. This has been trending all over my For You page, so I figured I would sit down and do it on myself. This trend is honestly so pretty. But yeah, let's get right into this video. I'm super excited to try this look out. It looks so pretty online, so let's get into it. Have my eyes all primed and ready to go. I also did my brows off camera to save some time. I'm going to use the ABH Norvana palette. It has just the most perfect shade, this one right here. And then I'm going to use these two in the bottom. It has that perfect cherry red, wine red color. So that's what we're using. I'm going to just start with a really, really small brush like this just to kind of put the color on. I'm just going to take E4 and pack it on the outer and inner corners. I'm going to pack it like that and I'm just going to with this kind of fluffy brush and I'm just going to start blending it out. So we get some softer edges. Okay, I'm just going to take this fluffy brush and go into C5, that red color, and I'm just going to pack this right in the center and blend it out. I'm gonna go back in with that first color. I'm just gonna bring some of that deepness back where I feel like I've lost it. Okay, I'm gonna grab a brush like this, a little angled brush. I'm gonna dip into E5 and kind of create a little wing with the black shadow. I'm gonna take a little brush and just kind of blend that out. And then all I'm going to do is just clean up that edge real quick. Okay, and then now for the fun part is the gloss. I'm going to go into this lip oil and hope that it doesn't like mess it up. I would definitely recommend using an eye gloss instead just because they're made for the eye. So I just tap it on with my eye rather than the finger. Let's see. Ooh. Why have I like not hopped on this sooner? Okay, I immediately need to go find myself an eye gloss because that's gorgeous. Okay, I'm gonna go do this eye off camera, finish the rest of my face, and then we'll go back for the under eye. Okay, this is how we're looking so far. Still a little crazy. I think the look will be all put together once I get the lips and the lashes on. For blush, I just used this little dewy blush by that brand. Uh, it's a glossy cheek tint in the shade Coconut. I got this in an Ipsy bag. Oh, I'm blurry. I got this in an Ipsy bag, and it's so pretty. I figured it would match the vibes better than my other bright peachy colors. A little worried about putting lashes on, because I'm not sure if it'll stick to the eye. I feel like I should have done the gloss like after I put my lashes on. But I've never done something like this before so it's new to me but it looks great. Don't know how a lip oil would last throughout the day. I don't know. But it's really making me want to buy a like a eye gloss. So I'm gonna do some research, see which one's the best one on the market and purchase it because I'm obsessed. Anyways, let's move on to the eyes or the rest of the eyes. I'm kinda gonna do the same thing I did in the crease where I'm just gonna do the E4 color in the outer and inner corner and then I'll put the red in the center. So I'm gonna dip into E4. I'm gonna go with a little small, small brush like this and I'm just gonna pack this in the outer and inner corners of the lower lash line. I'm going to C5 and I'm going to put that right in the middle. I'm just going to blend all this out. I'm going to take a little brush like this and then just kind of like tap off whatever's on there. And I'm just going to kind of drag the lower lash. Well, not really drag, but just blending out these edges. I kind of want to take a little bit of this translucent powder and just kind of blend with it. Let's do some mascara. I'm hoping that my lashes will stick. I'm kind of scared that they're not. I also feel like I should have put the lashes on and then the gloss. I'm going to go with this real quick before the mascara. Just a little black pencil liner. I'm going to line my lash line. Oh yeah, that, that, that adds. Now I'm going to do what mascara. I'm going to do these bad boys. Kind of like shorter in the front and longer in that back. Cut my lashes. I'm going to take this black lipstick and just kind of line my lips with it. I don't have a black lip liner. Then I'm going to take this red Morphe lipstick and just kind of put it in the center. So 
that too dark? I don't know. Then I'm just add a little red lip gloss. I'm gonna blot a little bit. It's kind of dark. Okay, 14 year old me is like thriving with this dark lip. I used to be so obsessed with dark lipsticks. It was like a phase. <laughs> I grew out of it. Freshman me, she loved a dark lip. I think dark lips were actually trending around that time too, so it makes sense. Because everything though, it's kind of like sultry, kind of vampy. It feels so pale. Compared to the rest of the look, I feel so pale. Should I add like some bronzer? I feel super, super pale. That helps a little bit. That that helped a little bit. I'm just blush on top oh that helped oh yeah i look less pale okay this is the final look i am living for it i never thought that i would love a glossy eye this much i would always see them on my like, like my for you page and instagram and the pinterest and all that and i'm like mm, it's cute but I don't think it's for me no it's for me it is 1000% for me definitely going to be ordering me some eyeglasses because I don't think this lip oil is gonna last all day <laughs> I feel like once you know it'll just start moving around so I don't think an oil would be the best for your eyes and I googled it and they said you couldn't really put like lipstick or like lip gloss on your eye because it can like cause infections I guess they said you can use one that you like haven't used on your mouth um, but still probably don't do that because like it was made for your lips not your eyes kind of thing um, but that's all I had so I used a lip oil because my lip glosses are kind of stained with pigment and I didn't want the pigment to mess up the eye look so I went with the lip oil instead looks great but I don't see the lasting all day so I would definitely recommend a, a eye gloss specifically for your eyes absolutely will be doing this again 1000% I love this this trend is definitely a 10 out of 10 absolutely we weren't writing the trend we were just doing the trend but I'm writing this trend a 10 out of 10 it is gorgeous so that is how I got my red wine makeup look thank you guys so much for watching I hope you enjoyed be sure to the subscribe button down below hit that bell so you get notified if I post a new video also be sure to like and comment down below that you see next and also be sure to follow me on my socials so you get more content pricing things and be sure to follow me on tiktok because we are doing some fun 25 days of christmas so be sure to follow me on there. This outro is kind of long, so I'll see you in the next one. Bye. So I have my eyes primed and ready to go. My bun is all kinds of crooked. Hold on, my mirror's dirty. I'm gonna take a little brush and, hold on, it's like really dirty and dusty. <laughs> Oh, my bun like fell. I didn't realize that. Honestly giving. Like, I don't know why I haven't done this sooner. Do I do it on the lower lash too? Like, do I put the gloss on the lower lash too? I don't know. We'll figure it out. I just know it's giving and that's all that needs to happen. Okay, I'm gonna kind of... This look is everything, honestly. Just need some lashes and some like a dark lip. Let's see, is sultry the right word? Maybe not. Yeah, sultry. It's like a very sultry look. Very mysterious. I feel like I look ridiculous without the lashes and the lipstick. So let's move on. Where's my there it is? See, I don't even know what I'm doing. Okay, I kinda wanna I like that'll match the or I don't want a lipstick that'll match. Oh wait, I haven't even done lashes yet. <sighs> okay. YouTube video while I pick off this glue. <laughs> Got lipstick on my mouth. I mean, my teeth. I used to be so obsessed with dark lipstick, like it was my bun fell. Lipstick's a little uneven, but you know, that's fine. The lipstick was not cute. There we go. Absolutely taking pictures with this today. Let's see. Oh yeah, that's everything. I won't take it off. I have to because I have some... I have to because I got other things to film. I don't want to take it off. The lipstick on the lips or the, <laughs> the lipstick on the teeth is not cute. Love that for me. Absolutely gonna film a TikTok in this. I have to. Okay. Okay.